Does your narcissist want to control all the finances? You see, a lot of times with narcissists, they want to control everything. And as a result, they'll get into your life, into your friends, into your family, and especially into your finances. They'll dig into those so much that you can't spend a single penny or a single dime without them coming at you. Hey, if you guys don't know who I am, my name is Ben Taylor, Raw Motivations here. I'm a self-aware narcissist, a narcissist that's in recovery, trying to bring awareness to people about narcissism, trying to help influence others with healing, growth, and change to be able to better myself, to be able to help other people to grow and continue along their journey. A lot of times I interact with people who deal with narcissism. I talk to a lot of guys, some gals that have narcissistic traits and are asking me, hey, how did you become self-aware? What did you work on? How did you get to the place where you can work through certain things? And I work with them like one-on-one -on -one, trying to help them to get better and to build a better life. I also work a lot with people who suffered from narcissistic abuse where their spouse or their partner was a narcissist and resulted in a lot of abuse, whether that's verbal, verbal, physical, emotional, like whatever it might be, I work with a lot of people with that as well. If you're interested in talking more about that, uh, go to my website, rawmotivations.com, click on one-on-one -on -one and grab a time. would love to talk to you. Anyway, so narcissism and finances. So a lot of times people are like, yes, narcissists love to control things. Well, one thing that, pe that people don't realize that they love to control immensely is they love to control finances because finances are one way that they can control you. And as a result, when they control your finances, they control every single aspect about you. So you get to the place where you go out and you grab a cup of coffee. You come home, the narcissist looks at your bank statement, looks at the app that you're on and is like, wait, why did you spend this money? Where were you going? Who were you with? What were you doing? And all of a sudden just the attacks come and they come and they come because they are against you forming any type of relationship with anyone else. They're against you having a lot of fun. They're against you doing anything that's going to take away from that praise, worship, and adoration of them. Because as a result, all they want is everything about them. Number one, everything focused on them. So give me an example. When I was interacting with other different people, like I would get super jealous of different things. I would get super possessive of different people of, no, I don't want you to go out with this person. Like, don't you care about me? Like, don't you want to spend time with me? Well, all the while, like I was just wanting to control that person. I was just wanting to get all the supply, all the validation from that one person. And if I felt that they were starting to give validation to someone else, even in a healthy way, if I felt that they were giving validation to someone else, I'd want to control that. So I'd control that by communicating to them about, you know, I don't think that friend's the best friend for you or communicating to them like, well, I thought you wanted to spend time with me. I thought you loved me. Communicating any type of thing to be able to control the situation. When it comes to finances, a lot of times narcissists want to control that incredibly. Like so much so that they'll scream, they'll yell, they'll get upset when those finances are touched and when different things are touched when it comes together of you guys trying to talk through finances. Now you might have run into the issue of, hey, let's set up a budget. Or maybe the narcissist is like, hey, we need a budget. And then you guys sit down, start talking, and all of a sudden it becomes this giant blow up, this giant raging maniac in one sense, like attacking you of the budget. A lot of times they're going through a lot of different emotions, a lot of different things. But the biggest thing is they don't want to lose control of another person. So as a result, they will do just about anything to be able to keep a hold of that person. I've heard stories of people that they can't spend any money at all or they got their cards taken away from them because the narcissist won't let them spend money. When we talk about control, there's people that have been locked out of their houses or the houses have been all automated and they haven't had access to the house because the narcissist wanted control. Narcissists love control because if they can control you, they can keep that supply all to themselves while they do everything else out there besides be faithful to the person. So has that happened to you? Have you been with someone that has had a big issue with finances, a big issue with controlling every single penny, controlling every single thing that you do? Oftentimes you'll see that and one of those ways is finances. I hope you guys find healing and growth. I hope you guys subscribe, watch more videos. We're still working on growing and developing this channel, growing and develop TikTok, Instagram, Facebook. I uh, would love to have you follow. If you're interested in talking more, reach out.